What's going on guys, it's Shane. I'm back here with another video. Today we're going to be finally returning to upstate New York, owned by Midwest Bus Company. Yes, the game was down for quite some time due to an exploiting issue with the group. The games were taken down, all of that kind of stuff. We did obtain the group and we did um, work on the spring update uh, while the group was taken back, uh, which is why we couldn't publish the games, you know, right when we got the group back. So, um, here's the spring update. Um, first thing you may be able to notice is the lighting change. Uh, it almost looks like a bloom effect on your screen, doesn't it? It looks so different. Um, I had no partake in the lighting. That was all Jimbo, so props to you. Um, but I did have, uh, partake in all of the trees. Um, yeah. If you look back last spring, the trees were so, so boring. Uh, mind you, I say spring, not summer. Spring. If you look at my videos from springtime last year, the trees were just... Ugh, it was horrible. Okay. Anyway, um, I am a little sick. If you hear a slight change in my voice, that is what it is. Um, it's the season changes and, you know, it's, it's getting rough out here. Anyway, um, the update. Right. Let me go ahead and list some of the stuff that we changed. Um, so spring update is here. There is a new museum and a new motel, mo motel, motel, um, the motel was built by me, the museum was built by a former developer who no longer works with NBC, uh, so there's that, um, there is a massive expansion to the farm, uh, and what that essentially means is that, do you guys remember the old farm that was by the bus services center? That farm, I, 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 I added it back to the map, but I put it way in the back over there where the barn is and stuff. Um, so we'll go check that out. Um, and then we also added uh, a little expansion to Swansbury over there. Uh, you can see it from here. Um, there's like a little extra road that goes back there and some houses. Um, and then we added... Uh, shout out to Mac Launcher for this uh, major construction in preparation for summer. We have huge plans for Upstate uh, for summertime. Uh, we we're, we're trying to make the the city, quote unquote, or town. Uh, we're trying to expand it, make it more modern. Um, some of these buildings are very outdated, mind you. Anywhere you see construction, there's usually going to be some changes there, uh, and we'll we'll drive past past some construction today. Uh, so you guys can see that. Um, and then we also added green waters for St. Patrick's Day for like a joke or something. And then Mac, re Mac Launcher, he revamped the uh, ES school lot, as you can see right there. It's got three lanes now uh, and a whole revamped parking lot. Let me, let me know how you guys like that because I was a little... Uh, I didn't know what to think about it at first, but I think it's okay now. Uh, and then I did redesign the uh, firehouse. Um, the old one was just horribly built if you look at it up close so i just kind of redesigned it we'll take a look at that as well um and then we had some minor bus fixes we removed all the snow all the ice all that good stuff uh and then we were we also removed the snow plow from the um vip game pass uh so you won't be able to spawn in the snow plow anymore until next winter so there's that um and then new spring lighting uh as you can see um, and if you guys stick around to the end of the video, I'm going to announce two more things that are going to be added um, that were supposed to be added in this update, but they'll be added in the next one. So stick around. Um, we're just going to kind of um, look around. Let me just spawn this bus in. Oh, God. That's never happened before. That's literally the first time my bus has ever done that. Okay. <clears throat> okay. There we go. Now, I have to say a few things. Um, our game was reverted. We had to revert back just in case the exploiters put some sort of virus in the game or anything like that. So, uh, this whole row of buses on the left right there is probably... Um, if your bus isn't spawning correctly, uh, we are aware and we're fixing it. Um, most these parking spots right here on the left, uh, they're probably spawning in backwards. Uh, and we do know that, so we're fixing that as well. So that's like the biggest bug report we have. Um, but yeah, here's the new uh, ES lot we're going to pull in here. Take a look at this. 
Um, so you kind of pull in as you normally do. But you got three lanes here. Uh, you know, you always want to try to use the first lane. <clears throat> you know, the farthest lane to the right. Um, but when it gets full, you go from the second and then to the third. And then all you do here is follow the arrows, please. And then, yeah, we got like another little entrance right here, actually. Um, which is meant for... I guess buses could pull in there. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, it's normally meant for like cars and stuff, though. But, yeah. Now we're going to head by the motel. <clears throat> it is a older looking motel. Uh, it was a motel that I built when I first started developing. Uh, so you could see a change to it. Here it is right here. Um, it's got actual doors and stuff, windows and staircases. Um, we'll pull in here. Uh, and here's the expansion, by the way. It's just a small road. Um, here's the motel. Um, not the best looking one. It's all made out of stone. You can see the stairs right there. Um, but, you know, it, it's something I built when I first started developing. So, um, you might see a revamp to this for sure. And now we will go on the, um, <clears throat> we'll go on the little expansion road here. I thought this would be cool to add just a little something new over here. But yeah. My god. You can see the green water right there. <clears throat> All the water is pretty much green. You see like almost a waterfall right there. Oh my god. Man, I hate being sick. I really hate it. <clears throat> and that's pretty much it for the little expansion over here. I think every, everything over here is pretty much still the same. Uh, now we will head to the little construction area and then the museum. I know I'm breaking a lot of road rules right now, but... It's okay. Let me know how you guys like this lighting. Um... It does change, uh, I think, I'm pretty sure, like, when the sun goes down, uh, you can see, like, a little, uh, sunset-type glare, so, at least I think you can, I'm pretty sure you can, you just have to set the time, I don't know how to do that, I keep forgetting how to do that, actually, let's see, time, six, oh, yeah, see, look, right there, look at that. That's so beautiful. Oh my god, let me actually get like a screenshot of that. Hold on. Oh no. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> but let me uh, actually time. Let me do like nine. There we go. Put it back here. So you still got the karate place over here. Um, there was a minor change to the MS. Uh, there's like a little phone number thing. I'm going to show you. Uh, well. I'll just show it to you guys now, but it says like teachers wanted uh, and stuff like that, um, which is pretty cool. And then it gives you like a number to call, which is like a fake number, but yeah. Um, we are driving past the new firehouse. It's not really new. It's just, it's scaled up a little bit and it's built a lot better. You guys may notice a little difference in the textures, um, the firehouse doors and stuff like that. But look at that. It looks a lot better if you ask me. And it says like station one right there. Very, very nice. <clears throat> Props to me. Um, here's some more construction. Shout out to Tiny the Gamer. Uh, one of our developers building this fancy looking store right here. It almost looks like an Ulta, you know, for all my females out there that go shopping there. Um, and any males, you never know. Uh, but yeah, it's coming soon. Look at that. Awesome. Uh, and some of you guys may be wondering why some of the stuff's fallen right there. You think it's unanchored, but it's supposed to be like that because it's like a construction zone, you know. Um, I built this little construction piece right here. Um, there used to be houses here, but I don't have any plans to put anything here. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't really know why I put a little construction area right here, but I guess I'll put some stores there. I'm not too sure. Uh, if they don't look right, I'll just end up putting houses back here. But yeah. <coughs> Here's the major construction area over here, though. Um, if you look right here, look at that. 
Um, yeah, it's got cranes, it's got workers, it's got a freaking portable, it's got dumpsters, it's got dump trucks, freaking, not dump trucks, uh, bulldozers, and stuff like that. Um, you go slow through here, um, and it kind of shows you what it's going to look like if you look right there. It's literally going to be a plaza. It's really, really cool. Um, let me take a screenshot right here too, just in case. Um, but yeah, you can see kind of the little building progress right here, which is really cool. It's coming in the summertime, so you guys will be able to see this, see this building very soon. Uh, very, very cool. Uh, some of you guys are probably wondering what's happening. If you had any buildings over here, they'll probably be moved. Um, so, yeah. Nothing's really changed with the hospital over there. Nothing's really changed right here. You can kind of see the museum from here. Yeah, no, nothing's really changed here. My god, these trees, though. I need to replace those. Don't mind those. <clears throat> Oh man, I hate being sick. It's the worst thing in the world. Well, actually, if you think about it, it kind of is. When people are dying, they're usually sick, so it's really the worst thing in the world. Being sick sucks. I don't know who ended this road right here. That was pretty dumb of them. I It literally led to a cul-de-sac, which is fine. There was nothing wrong with that. Um, but then, here is the museum. Shout out to... I would give you props, but I don't really like you. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just the way it is. But, yes, it was built by someone that no longer works at NBC. Uh, but shout out to you. Um, yeah. Pretty cool looking museum. Got the bus parking here. I will say it only fits 10 buses. Uh, depending on the amount of complaints we get about that, I will see about changing or adding more spots. So, you can't go inside the museum, which is to be expected, but yeah, it's a museum nonetheless. It looks good right here, so yeah, not bad. I should take a screenshot right here. Anyway, now we're going to head to the farm. Now we are going to head to the farm. Oh boy. Sorry, I'm driving all off the road. Man, I needed to add more trees over here. There's like no trees here. Oh boy. My apologies. So, like I said, the old farm I added back. Um, so, you know, you remember when you could like park at that farm to do like Halloween stuff? Like, um... Christmas stuff and stuff like that. I added that back. You can see it here. There's like a whole layout. I still don't know why there's a football field back here. Just randomly. Random football field. Anyway, here's the old farm. It's back. I did keep the hay bales right here because it represents a farm. So they're going to stay there. Very nice. You can pull in here. You can park up. You can do... Pretty much anything. You can have like a little bus meet if you want. Or a field trip or something like that. <clears throat> but yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, <clears throat> nothing really new. But yeah. Just added back. Uh, and then I did add like a little dirt road right there too. Let's see. Yeah. So you can still enter this way. I put like a little dirt road going up to the barn, which is pretty cool. But yeah, that's pretty much the change over here. Sorry. Um, yeah. Uh, where'd that sunlight go? There you are. Some of these trees I meant to replace. The ones without any trunks in them, I gotta replace those. Now I also added these blue signs. Shout out to Tiny Gamer for making those as well. They represent the high school pride of Putnam County. See pride. Actually, you're supposed to. It's supposed to go high school pride, not. Wait, Putnam pride. Yeah, no. It's supposed to be. It's backwards. But yeah, symbolizes the pride here for 
Putnam County. Uh, nothing's really changed over there. I might add something, uh, something there for like field trips and stuff. I don't really know yet, but yeah, I think that's pretty much everything. I could be wrong. Um, let me double check real quick here. So you've seen the construction, you see the motel museum farm. So the ES lot, you saw this, you saw the new firehouse. That's pretty much it. Um, but yeah, we have big plans for the summertime for NBC. Or not just for NBC, but for Upstate. Uh, NBC's got bigger plans that don't involve Upstate. Freaking voice crack. Oh my god. Anyway, I think that's it. So, in the comments down below, let me know what you guys think of this update. Uh, it was obviously better than last spring's update. Um... Like I said, if you look at the old videos of the spring update in my last, uh, like last year, it was, it was pretty bad. I'm not going to lie. Um, but yeah, I realized some of the staff commands still might not be working. I'm not too sure. Uh, we'll have to fix that still. Uh, somebody said there's problems wrong with the buses still. Um, I will try to fix those, um, if I can. Um, I'm not the best bus developer, but I can always try. But, uh, yeah, so, for those of you who stuck around, I'm going to be giving you... I, I passed my spot entirely. Let me just... Keep on backing up. There we go. 11.47. Okay. So, <clears throat> I know a lot of you are interested in new buses. How about an old bus? Um, we have plans to add a 2005 Bluebird Vision, um, which is pretty cool if you ask me. It's going to be a game pass. Uh, you know, NBC got to make that money. But um, yeah, it's one of the cooler buses. Honestly, I think uh, having an older bus like that we don't have an older vision in game like that uh and to get one would be very very cool so you guys are gonna be able to see that soon uh it's probably gonna be priced around all the other game passes so not too expensive uh and then also the premium radios are supposed to come back as well um they were supposed to come back in this update but i wasn't home to help jimbo with that uh so they will come in the next one anyway yeah let me know how you guys like the um the spring update down below um if you guys want to play this game yourself it will be linked in the description down below as always uh, if you guys like the video please leave a like and subscribe and i will catch you guys next time peace